I picked up this pair on eBay for about £25.50 as not working. There you go. Twenty twenty-five pounds forty-six delivered. And there's the the power pack. And as it happens, it does it does work. But I was interested to find out what is actually inside one of these power packs. Now, it's for the Nintendo Game Boy, and I've got a Nintendo Game Boy Color here. And the bottom looks quite similar. It looks like it might fit. But don't use one of these with one of these, because for a start, the the jack only wants three volts and I don't know if you can work that out but it's it's positive polarity on the center pin and the power pack is negative polarity on the center pin and it's pushing out 5.3 volts so that could damage that so don't use these power packs on the on the newer Game Boys, designed for the original Game Boys only. So what's inside of here? Well, I'm going to have a look. Now this is charged up. So I don't recommend it. Don't do this at home. And if you do do it and you get an electric shock off it, don't blame me. It does have 240 volts going into the bottom. So there'll be a capacitor, probably, maybe. There could be a capacitor charged up inside of here. But I'm curious to know what's inside. So if I'm curious, somebody else might be. I think this is one of them game bit. Game bit screwdrivers. Oh, there's an old, an old fashioned transformer look. With a 600, 4.8 volts, 600 milliamps. It looks, they must be stuck in. I'll leave them in. That's what's inside. You could. Probably replace that battery pack. Here's DMG 03E. There's a small transformer in there. Now, don't take my word on this. So, you've got 240 volts coming in to a transformer. And then I think out of the transformer it goes to a bridge rectifier, which Presumably turns it into DC and then charges the battery up. Does that sound about right? There's nothing else on there. Doesn't seem to be any level of battery charging protection or anything like that. Not that I can see. So Rechargeable battery pack, that's what's inside. 220 volts in, 5.3 volts out. Charge time, 8 hours. No capacitors in there after all. I'll put that back on. That's it. If you ever wanted to know, what's inside of there this video was for you and i will see you in the next one thanks for watching